Hey Name Tags and welcome back. This is Ash from Heal My PC. Before I start, I'm gonna to apologize to you guys. This is gonna be a bit scruffy, it's unedited, it's gonna be unedited, unscripted, and uh, unprepared. The reason is I'm traveling tomorrow, urgently, family thing, so I actually may not be able to upload a few videos for the next two weeks. For today, I've got with me a desktop. This was actually a desktop I built for a client about over a year ago. It's a normal desktop with day-to-day uh, -day browsing needs and uh, office needs. And it's got, probably just got an AMD dual core on the FM2 platform, four gigabyte of RAM, nothing major. My client tells me that when he turns it on, um, there's no display coming on. So we're gonna see what happens. So this is what happens when we turn it on. If you've got a display, nothing's coming on. So I'm just gonna check. See, like, make sure I've selected HDMI, and there's nothing coming on, right? So, I've diagnosed the problem. If you have a look, I'm going to switch it off, and let's hope that you guys can see this. Now, this was a an adapter, a four pin CPU to eight pin adapter. Take it off because this was an eight pin plug because the motherboard had eight pin CPU plug. And the power supply came with only a four pin plug now what happened for some reason i hope you guys can see let me focus this in this got blown blown off can you see it's burnt right and initially i didn't see this and i thought the problem was with the power supply but it turns out this was blown now i don't know the reason why this was blown probably this connection was a problem or there was extra heat or wrong voltage was sent from this power supply. This is a cheap power supply, by the way. It's about 14 pounds. And I wouldn't recommend this if you want to do a build which should last you a long time. Definitely not for a gaming build. But what we're going to try and do, first of all, the client only wants this replaced because it wants minimum cost. So we're going to do that. So I've procured myself a similar 4-pin female to 8-pin plug. And we're going to swap that and we're going to test it so hopefully that should do the trick now i wouldn't generally recommend you do this i.e the four to eight pin adapter but for now that's what the client wants so we're going to do that i would actually recommend you get yourself a proper power supply and uh, this time hopefully you should see on the screen something coming up if we've done this correctly Input HTML, voila, Ubuntu 14 point something, okay, so this should be booting, so while this is booting, I'm talking to you guys, so what happens is a lot of times, although in this case, we have a power supply which is turning on, there are some LED lines, uh, so, sorry, some LED lights, the CPU fan is turning on, but because there was no power coming into the CPU pin for the CPU plug, therefore it looked like it wasn't turning on and again similar to our previous one where we found out the problem was that i plugged in the cpu pin the four pin in the wrong way it wasn't delivering enough or it wasn't delivering the actual voltage to the cpu plug so that could be the problem again not necessarily a graphics card issue so guys once again so this is on i'm quite gonna happily just put this on sleep so this was a quick fix and uh Power supply is something you should never underestimate. Although you may see signs of power coming in and fan spinning and LED lights, you should always check whether it's delivering the correct voltage, whether it's working and whether all the plugs are connected the right way. And once again, I would advise you to get a better power supply than this one if you wanted to make sure you don't have any further problems. I don't recommend cheap power supplies. I have used cheap power supplies in a few builds, which I didn't care much for whether they would uh, explode or not my advice to the client is really to get a better power supply but that would cost him a bit more money he doesn't want to do this at this point in time anyway thank you guys so much for watching thank you for the questions and i'm going to try to respond to each of them either by either by a response in the comments or in a form of a video tutorial for your various problems i'm aware that you guys want to see a lot of troubleshooting issues which we're going to do so once again i'm going to see you guys down in mauritius maybe doing some pc stuff or maybe doing some travel vlog with eating stuff. So hopefully you're going to, you're going to want to see this. I'm going to be on a motorcycle with a helmet and a GoPro. And also I've got myself a few new equipment. So hopefully we're going to be using that. And once again, thank you for watching. This was Ash from My PC. Don't forget to like, dislike, comment and share this vid. And leave me a request below if you want anything. And until next time, 
Peace out.